Once everything is set up in the app, open VR Chat. Long press the B or Y button. Select Options. Select OSC. And enable OSC. After enabling OSC, open the launch pad. And you should see calibrate full body tracking options, not sit or stand. If you don't see this, please double check your previous steps. Now, stand in front of a mirror and click the calibrate full body tracking options. Stand in a T pose. Make sure your phone camera can track your whole body and keep facing your phone. Press both trigger buttons on your controllers at the same time. Now your full body tracking works. If you notice that the trackers are sideways, or if you find that the avatar is severely distorted, please try using the auto center. To auto center, please click calibrate full body tracking. Then go to settings. Click auto center OSC trackers. You can test it with a kick. If the trackers move strangely, click auto center again until everything is good. Then make a T pose. Press both triggers to complete calibration. Then the tracking should be good. If you've tried auto center but the avatar still moves strangely, please try the following steps. Enable calibration visuals on the settings page. Then recalibrate. The blue lines indicate the trackers are considered to be which parts of the avatar. So you can see where the trackers are attached to the avatar. This is the normal case. The trackers are attached to their corresponding joint nodes. In this case, the hip tracker is attached to the knee. If we continue to calibrate, we'll find that the avatar's movements become very strange. In this case, the knee trackers are attached to the ankles. We'll find that the avatar's lower legs cannot move. Therefore, it's very important to attach the trackers to the right places. We can adjust the attachment position by adjusting the height in the app. Looking up and down in VR chat may also help. In general, the more accurately the trackers are aligned, the better the tracking effect will be. Hope you enjoy your full body tracking. Bye bye.